It's been it's been great, you know. First year, um, just really been a, a great start. Our first four practices, you know, I've really been just emphasizing having great energy at practice. Um, you know, I'm, I'm a high energy guy. Anybody that knows me knows that. Um, I'm really, just trying to end that to our players that you know it's, this game's about passion, and so that's really what we've been the first year. You know, trying to do things the right way, little things, um, all that. So having that energy and doing all those little things lead to, lead to that big thing, you know, and, and winning games and, and doing things the right way. So it's, it's been great, great start. It helps that you know these guys. You've been around these guys. Uh, talk to me about this team and, and really the biggest thing they've been able to improve on this, this offseason. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we you know we had a great year last year. Um, losing 13 seniors, you know, hurts. But our seniors this year have done a great job of, of coming in, having an open mind. And, and our, our commitment to each other has just been really good. Um, we have a great locker room, and that's a testament to, to our seniors and to our juniors and, and being leaders. Um, I think the biggest thing we've improved on is just being positive in practice. And you know, that's the only thing I've been preaching. You make a mistake, so what? we got to go to the next play. You know, this game's about play after play, and, and our guys have done a great job of picking each other up, and especially our seniors, um, picking each other up and, and being the leaders that we need to be vocal leaders, leading by example. So it's been, it's been really good so far. Uh, some of our strengths, you know, we <clears throat> with I already have a relationship with some most of these guys, so it's you know they they trust me, so they're buying into what we're doing. Um, so and you know another strength we have is we have some good depth up front on our offensive line, and we're going to be able to run the ball a little bit more this year. So I think just being able to get the ball in our athletes' hands, whether it's quarterback, running back, receiver, um, that's going to be a great strength, and and our commitment to each other is another strength uh, that we have. So and another strength we have is. You know, we're doing stuff very similar to what we did last year, even though I'm a new head coach. I've been in the, in the program for six years, so there's no nothing brand new that we're doing, so the kids feel comfortable what we're doing. So that's, you know, we get into practice, we get into doing drills. We're able to go right through drills and get better every day because because we have that continuity. What's been the emphasis of practice leading up to the open? Uh, leading up to the open is just, just making sure we have energy and doing the little things right. Uh, whether we're jogging over, get a drink, make sure you're, you're jogging off the field. Um, just, you know, having the right technique when you're tackling. It's just making sure that we are together and that, and that we're having that energy because this game, you need that when you're you know, playing this game because it's, it's, it's a brutal game and you've got to be able to to, to want to play fast and play hard. And I think that's what we've really been trying to emphasize is just play fast the whole time you know, and, and do the little things right. Who are some of the players in your team that are going to have some big roles? Uh, you know, we'll starting with our, our captains, uh, our quarterback, Blake Schutte. He's going to have a big role with being one of our main leaders and, and taking care of the ball. Um, Tim Taylor's our, our senior running back. Um, you know, he had a good year, 700-plus yards last year, so we're going to rely heavily on those two. Um, you know, we have, we have experience at receivers with Jordan, Berkeley, uh, Landon Reyes, and then we got to play some new guys on the outside with some, you know, with some Caden Recker and, and Chase Clark. And then, you know, we have some seniors up front, um, Isaac Garrett, and then our junior, Dylan Hines, center, like, we're going to have to rely on those guys heavily. And um, our other senior captain, Quincy Brenneman, is a, is a great uh, leader for us defensively. So we're going to lean heavily on those guys to, uh, to help us through the year. So what are some of the things you learned from last year? I think last year, just the way we were able to um, have the commitment to each other. You know, we were, had a, a, a good year last year being 6-4 and four, and just seeing the camaraderie that our team had with, with our seniors. Um, you know, and the seniors create the atmosphere. And our seniors right now are doing a great job of that, of creating that commitment to each other. Um, and then just <clears throat> anywhere we go, just doing, you know, leading by example, representing Antwerp the right way, I think, is, is one thing I really learned last year from Coach Altimus is anywhere we're at, we carry ourselves the right way to represent Antwerp football. Talk a little bit about the performance aspect. How's that help you working with PSM Performance? Oh, it's it's been tremendous. Um, you know, PSM Performance came in the summer, did our evaluation, and then um, you know we had a six seven week program that I was able to work with Scott on and and develop that. And not only has it helped us in football, the other sports. You know, we've gotten compliments, and you know, and I think the kids have really enjoyed it. And just our improvement, our flexibility, our strength. You know, kids. Kids, I really feel like kids are lifting harder this year because they have, understand how important it is. And being able to work with PSM Performance got them to be able to see how important it is, and it's just going to help us tremendously uh, throughout the year. Thanks, Coach. Yeah, Good sure. luck. This offseason, getting ready for, for one last year. Uh, I'm excited that we, uh, 
we're work really working hard over the summer. We really hit the weights hard. Uh, we've seen some adversity early on, and the guys really jumped in, and they're, they're working hard and trying to adjust to the new system, the new plays, and I'm just really proud of them, and I'm hoping for the best this season. How's this senior class kind of help coach get into that head coaching role? I know he's been with you in the past, but, you know, working together to, to get this going under him. Uh, we're just really trying to push, having energy, working hard in practice, and going hard during every rep and learning the new plays as best as we can. Uh, we want to hit the, the first game running, hopefully, and try to try to surprise who we got because we're very young this year and we're hoping to make the best out of it. What's the uh, biggest thing this team's worked on, do you think, it, to improve this offseason? Uh, like I said, we really hit their weights hard and we've been working on our energy and trying to just make sure everybody knows what they're doing all the way down to the – from the very bottom to the top, so we're not just you know one strong in one in a single position. So, like I said, the guys really jumped in and they've do, they're doing a great job. What like, do you think uh, some of the greatest strengths of this team are? Um, I think we're, well, like I said, we're very young, but I think that our strengths are that we're gonna we're gonna play for each other and we're gonna we're gonna do the best we have, making sure that we give it, give it all for the guy next to us. So. Um, what are some of the things you learned last season that you're going to apply to this, this next season? Uh, I got some really good experience uh, running the ball last year. It was a big, good learning year for me, and I'm hoping that I can help kind of take some of the load on offense, running the ball, and help showing the, ki the younger kids, especially the younger running backs underneath me, kind of giving them pointers, giving them things I've learned over the years. That way they don't have to go in blind and empty-handed. And also, I really, I just been focusing on trying to help lead the defense too, because, like Coach said, we did lose 13 seniors last year, so we're really rebuilding this year. So, last year for you, quarterback of the team. I mean, just to get out there again one last time. I mean, how how special is this uh, this upcoming season for you? Uh, it's been fun so far. Last year, I was playing some receiver because we had, we had a senior graduate last year that was playing quarterback, and I've been backing up him a couple of years. So it's just been fun to kind of control the team through practices and hopefully lead to some wins and games. What's the biggest thing you think this team has worked on in the off season to improve? Uh, just trying to learn the playbook. That we got some new coaches, so we're trying to learn what they what they like, what they want us to do, and getting in the weight room and getting stronger. Because I think last year sometimes we were put at a disadvantage because we weren't as strong as the other team we were playing. And uh, talk about coach coming in. I know he was with you guys in the past, but now he's the head coach. What's that transition been like, do you think? Uh, I think it's been a little easier since he's been around for a couple years. And some of the new coaches, I think they're starting to learn stuff. We're starting to learn what they like, what they want. Um, and I think coach has done a good job of getting people together. I think the team's getting pretty close, and there hasn't really been any issues. And just trying to get better every day in practice. A lot of those guys on that baseball team or on this football team do. That momentum of, of the run that you guys had, I mean, how does that carry over into really all the other sports? I mean, softball was good, too, and all that. For a school like Antwerp, that that momentum of, of all the sports athletics, how, how does that help you guys? Oh, it, it definitely helps because, you know, Antwerp hasn't really had a tradition of, at least us, of winning. So just having that in our belts, you know, winning all those games in that tournament run, it's been fun and just learning how fun, you know, you want to get back there. You know the feeling and you just want to do everything you can to get back to that stage. Who are some of the players you've seen that have had some big roles this season? Uh, Hunter Sproles. He's a sophomore. I think he's playing receiver and maybe safety on defense. Uh, he's just a really strong kid. One of the younger ones. He didn't really play. He played a little bit last year, but definitely has to step into a bigger role for us this year. And... Uh, Jordan Berkeley, he didn't really play last year very much. He's a junior. He'll play some defense, some offense. I think both of those guys, they can really help us if they put everything together and just keep doing what they're doing in practice.